starch solution and how it's working for me. Um, if you don't know what the starch solution is, it's a uh, book uh, by Dr. McDougall. Uh, we'll put the link to his websites and everything else like that in the description box, so you can go check that out. <laughs> that book there I actually got on Amazon um, before Christmas. Uh, it took about two months to get here, but they put it on a ship and had to ship it here. <laughs> So, uh, it only cost me um, three cents um, plus shipping and handling. So I paid only like four dollars for the book. It's a twenty dollar, twenty four dollar book. So make sure you check out Amazon. It doesn't. It's brand new, even though it says it's used. So anyway, <laughs> so uh, um, how I'm doing? I'm doing really good on it. Um, I haven't stepped on the scale. Um, this month, but last month I lost about five pounds. Um, I feel really good, really high energy. Um, it seems like sometimes if I don't eat enough, um, cravings come back, of course. Um, but I need to really judge how much I'm eating because um, it's a lot different than eating a bunch of fruit because um, you know fruit it takes a long time to get full off of fruit, at least for me. I can sit down and drink a 15 minute smoothie and I feel full, but not stuffed. Um, but if I sit down and eat like a um, 10 potato, uh, mashed potatoes, I, I can't even finish them all. It's really a lot denser food. So I'm still working on that, that, um, that problem. Not problem, but still working on that um, situation of um, knowing how much you can eat. Because being, um, I mean, I love, to, I love the banana, banana girl diet, the four all to four types of the eighty ten ten, whatever you want to call it. I love that, but it wasn't filling me up. Um, I was eating too much. I wasn't eating too much. I was just, it wouldn't fill me up. I wouldn't feel satisfied. But and I did that for, I did that for um, about three years, all told. So it's, it's, it's really good to really feel like something to actually fit. It took a little while to find it, <laughs> uh, but I still think the raw food is the best. But um, maybe, in the, maybe in the future, maybe we'll, depends where we move next. <laughs> um, maybe in the future, maybe I'll go back to Alta Floor or go back to um, 801010 or something like that. But I, I found the find too is um, I can eat 801010. I'm a starch solution. So, and I think, I think of what I remember hearing that Dr. Graham got it from um, cooked food. He just changed it to raw food. So, you can still eat 80 10 10 and cook, um, you can cook food. So, so like that, um, I know one day I did, I did have a little slip up. And, um, I had a whole avocado. Uh, which is good, you know, I mean, it, it's good every now and then, but it completely threw me off. I got really, felt really heavy, really, yeah. <laughs> the thing too, really funny and difficult is to, um, to make stuff with that oil, um, like baking. I, I, I make bread a couple times a week, and as simple as possible to get a good recipe, really, have the bread turn out really good. Bread turned out really good without oil, so I'm still experimenting with that. Yes, yesterday, uh, not yesterday, the day before, I uh, baked a brick in the oven. <laughs> so anyway, I'm kind of getting off topic, but I, I feel I'm feeling really good. Uh, my energy is really high. Um, my anemia is it getting better? I'm still not 100%. Um, I need to uh, get the test results back from the last blood work I did. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go back um, a couple of videos and I'll explain, I explain why I'm severely anemic. So, I'm feeling, like I said, feeling great. Um, weight is coming off slowly because I passed, of course. But my husband is seeing really some good results too. He's actually doing this with me. His skin is clear. His, you know, he had some acne and stuff like that. His skin's glowing. <laughs> Well, anyway, um, so that's my uh, next update um, on 
Research Solution. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and everything else like that. And uh, I'll see you guys next video.